a fossil hay from CFA. What's up guys? Ash Bigail here, owner of Charleston Fossil Adventures. It is an incredibly beautiful day today. Uh, it's 60s, February, great t-shirt weather. So we're about an hour out from low tide. Water is receding, uncovering lots of fossils. Let's not waste any more time and go see what's out there. No sooner had I stopped recording than I walked up on this incredible snaggle tooth. What a way to start things off. And we're not wasting any time. Teeth like this, uncovered by the tide. All right, maybe the next one will have a root. Check out this dolphin tooth I just found. That's going to be a cheek tooth from something like a, a Wipatiid or an Agarophiid dolphin. They had differently shaped cheek teeth than incisors. Here's a piece of ivory from the tusk of a mammoth or mastodon. And here's another. Boom! Beautiful little blade right there. Here's an uncommon find, but one that's always welcome. This is a rostral spine from a sawfish in the genus Anoxypristus. Pretty cool. We got one of these in the last video, but this one is gorgeous. Another modern tiger shark tooth. Pretty uncommon at a site that primarily has 28 to 30 million year old fossils. But since this is dredged material, we can get some younger ones that mix in, like this beauty. Another blade. Really muddy on that side. Glistening in the water, do you see it? Really nice shark vertebra. Gotta love finding these. There's another snaggle tooth. All right, in excellent condition. I never get tired of finding these. went down to the water's edge to rinse it off. And uh, look what we have here. Whew! Another really nice shark vertebra. I personally enjoy finding them with the limestone or phosphate still attached because usually that's going to mean that the vertebra you're finding is intact. They're so thin in the middle and calcified cartilage is so fragile that they often break into a bunch of little pie wedges. But not this one. And another snaggle tooth. You just have a gut feeling some days, like I'm going to go out and I'm going to find X well, today I was thinking, you know, I'm going to find a really nice whale tooth. And right underneath the water, right there. Lo and behold, a double rooted tooth. Oh, that is gorgeous. I will provide identification at this point in the video once I can figure out what type of dolphin this guy belonged to. Awesome. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right guys, here's the tooth of the day. Oh my goodness. Wow. 
I'm speechless. That is a really nice one. We've got cusplets, we've got the tip. Oh, that's beautiful. We're literally at low tide. Man. Well, my day is made. Anything else from here on out is icing on the cake. Okay, if you've watched enough of my videos, you know that not everything that is a fossil might look like a fossil when it's down on the sand. This blob right here is one of my favorite things to find. And this one is complete. That is an absolutely gorgeous periodic from a toothed dolphin. All right. I've collected quite a good number of these from here. And this guy will go hang out with the others in downtown Charleston at the Mace Brown Museum of Natural History. Very significant find right here. Very helpful for understanding the evolution of dolphins. Another tooth hiding in the water. Nice little lateral angie right there. Well, here's a nice little surprise. Hiding in a little pocket of gravel. Another angie. Lovely little lower snaggle tooth. Not so little, actually. What well, happens when you least expect it? I was eating lunch and boom, came across this incredible upper anterior tooth from Isurus oxyrhynchus, that modern mako shark. Wow. That is a really big one too. Nice. Look at this one, peeking through the sand. Is he all there? Oh, nope. But, that tooth is a tooth. And this one has some pretty good colors. And there's one right there. Nice little tiger shark tooth. Okay guys, I've got another great find here. Just like the whale tooth from earlier, this was something that I was thinking about on the paddle out here. I was, you know, just thinking about everything that I've found over the past few months and how, you know, some fossils are, are always very common. You can find them every single time you go out. Others, a little less common, like complete dolphin and whale teeth. And I get these teeth with some regularity. They are not extremely rare, but they are definitely uncommon. And lo and behold, here is another first of 2021 Ooh, yes it's complete this is a tooth from the false mako shark perodotus benedini all right this i mean this is the cherry on top of the frosting on top of the icing on top of that cake that that larger tooth from earlier made so truly anything else from here on out is just powdered sugar on top of this cherry. Here's a fun little fish tail. This is called the hypural bone. It's the last bone in the spine of a fish. Pretty neat little find. And if you enjoy having fossils identified and uh, you are new to the channel, I would really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button and also that bell to enable notifications whenever I post new content. 
I'm going to try to be more regular with my content in 2021 because the goal is to be able to live stream from my fossil sites. So I hope you've enjoyed the more frequent videos and uh, hopefully the quality of the content. This video should be super, super clear with the audio and that's because I recently upgraded my sound system that I use whenever I'm recording out here. So uh, your subscription, your likes, your comments, all of that really does help and uh, I'm indebted to each and every one of you. So thank you all so much for tuning in each time I post a video. The tide may be coming in, but that doesn't stop us from collecting these teeth. Another Isurus oxyrhynchus, Mako shark tooth. Let me uh, do a quick size comparison between this one, which is relatively standard, and the one that I found earlier. All right, so there's the one that I just found. Boom, there's the one from earlier. That's pretty cool. All right guys, as you can see, the sun is setting. I do have a long paddle back, so I hope you enjoyed the video. All of the really neat fossils I found, my favorites were the dolphin periodic, the ear bone, and that tooth, uh, the dolphin tooth. Let me know what your favorite was down in the comments. I would love to hear out of everything I found today, which you would have preferred to have found. As always, thanks so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, and turn on the bell to enable notifications whenever I upload a new video. And happy hunting until next time. See you guys.